Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Donna Smith Show with your host, Donna Smith. With interesting everyday life scenarios across the Bay Area relating to love, marriage, dating, and real life experiences. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your host, Donna Smith. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Donna Smith Show. Today, we have some exciting questions that we're going to discuss with our listening audience. Number one, we will discuss, will a kiss tell you if a person has skills or not? Number two, we will talk about a marriage between a man and a woman, and the wife is a cougar. He is no longer being satisfied by his wife. What should he do? And number three, we would like for you to share the worst dating experience that you have ever had. And our first question for you would be, do you think that a kiss tells if a person has skills or not? Because we all love to kiss. I know I do. Don't you? If you really love that person, Mm -hmm. you know, I don't think it matters if they have skills or not. Okay, that's a great answer. Um, I was going to say yes and no. Because one, someone could be a natural kisser, and I have heard that before. Like, someone could be just be naturally good at kissing, and it could, like, okay. So if you're really new to new to kissing, you don't know what a good kisser is, and so once you, you know get used to it and kiss a lot, and, you know get experience, then you you can tell the difference between someone who's inexperienced or someone who has experience with kissing. Well, someone who's a wild kisser. Yeah. Yeah, They're know, more experienced. Yeah, it just depends. I'm not, I don't really want to go into details of how. <laughs> okay. But. Well, that's great. That's great. Thank you. Thank you. Another feedback from the audience? Again, I would say yes and no, uh, but I would look at it like uh, from an experience I was in, I had a long term relationship. When we went our separate ways, I haven't kissed in a while, and then that first kiss with someone, it felt, it felt like. It was new to me all over again. In a relationship with a cougar, the man is frustrated because he is no longer being sexually stimulated by his cougar relationship. What would you do in a situation like that? Well, I think you're talking about me. <laughs> I did have a lot of cougar relationships. A lot? But I don't agree with you that, uh, well, that particular man may be frustrated, but I'm really excited because cougars are hot. <laughs> they yeah. are, yeah. But I would suggest that uh, don't get married with them because once you get married, then it will be like that man. But if just a plain relationship, that's great. Yeah. They are hot. They're hot. Yeah. Yeah. Very good response. (laughs) Anyone else? I I think I have a comment. Um, um, Well, the idea of a cougar relationship, I think, is um, short-lived because of the age gap. So um, it's kind of like a fun time or a fun season, but it's short-ended. Yeah, um, it goes out, right? Okay, great response. Any more, anybody else? And I was in that situation, if the cougar was not able to satisfy me, probably I'm looking for something younger. And if that was the case, I would just go back to you, somebody my age, you know, 10, 20, maybe 30 years younger than me. Oh, oh, <laughs> younger than me. Oh, younger, younger than the cougar. Oh, younger, younger than, than the cougar. cougar. Okay, I got you. Okay, <laughs> well, you kind of threw me with that one right there. I'm like, oh. Number three, we would like for you to share the worst dating experience that you have ever had. Oh, I went out on a date and this guy did not have enough money to pay for the food. 
Wow. That was terrible. And I had to dig out of my pocket and pay pay for the rest of the meal. Oh, you paid? Yeah. Oh, that was okay. the worst date ever. Wow, that, that sounds yeah. very good. I know that's true. I didn't like that at all. You asked me out, you paid. <laughs> I know that's true. Yeah. <laughs> Did he leave his wallet at home? Or? <laughs> no, he took his wallet out. And, oh, I didn't have enough money that day. <laughs> Anyone else? <sighs> oh, my God. I was so mad. So... <laughs> I was at a restaurant, you know, with my girlfriend, mm -hmm. and yeah. I'm kind of getting mad now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I, just, I, just, uh, I was having dinner one day, and um, it was like my first date with this girl, just taking her to dinner, and she just farted very extremely. Oh, <laughs> wow. That was cool. Did everyone <laughs> smell that? Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's my God. Dream. Oh, that's embarrassing. <laughs>